happy, happy everyone. Today's going to be a another postcard, what I'm calling postcards. Um, this one's going to have a little bit of dimension though. So we're going to use Newton's Nook creepy cameos stamps. And um, I did show you another stamp set there and I cannot remember what it is already. <laughs> but you'll see it in a minute. And I basically have a piece of A2, uh, four, what is it? Four by five and a quarter size card as my base and I'm going to or my postcard and I'm going to stamp it with a Tim Holtz wood grain stamp and I've just literally because it's a cling stamp I've just stuck it to my table my it clings to it so it's great and I'm using some distress ink in vintage photo surprise surprise and I am just pressing it down there you can use a piece of paper I the closest thing to me was my uh chamois no not my chamois my little cloth thing so I use that. It's just to stop you getting ink all over your hands. It's not a big deal. So I was hoping that this video I could do in a sort of real time thing, but it just, it, I was getting bored watching it in real time. So I just thought I can't subject you lovely guys and girls to that. So I decided against it and sped it up. And I thought I'll just do a voiceover as it is. So um, I've got the ink on in the wood grain just to give a bit of texture in the background I've then got my I've inked the edges as well and that just worked out really really well um, I also decided to um, ink the edges of these two little panels and this is basically Frankenstein and his love and it's two of the stamp or three of the stamp sets from a uh, stamps from that stamp set I was talking about from Newton's Nook uh, creepy cameos and I just stamped them using Versafine Onyx Black ink and um, on some Nina cardstock. On this piece, um, I stamped and embossed using the Happy Halloween and the two little, oh well, the bat. And I'm just onto some black cardstock and I'm just going to add a couple of brads. And this is to make it look like what's the word like rivets not ribbit like a frog <laughs> rivets <laughs> I can say it right um or like you know you could do like nail heads that kind of thing that was the idea in my head so that's that's what I've sort of got going on there I just remember what I needed to go to town for anyway random thought so I have that and I also inked it even though you, you can it kind of the ink goes over the top of the white embossing and that sort of works it just makes it look a bit more dull so it's not so bright white because let's face it everything if I've not said it enough before needs vintage photo so that's what I did so I'm just got some tape here uh, some foam tape and I'm just going to stick again 5,000 pieces of it onto it and I'm going to stick them on and the idea behind this is that it looks kind of like in my head it was like a plaque is that what you call it um, like a framed plaque type thing um, that's sort of the idea and of course the two loves are looking at each other and I just I can't help myself so I then put the little panel on the bottom so that bottom bit was kind of like it would be the you know the engraved bit on a on a plaque so that was the idea behind it but anyway so this is a more 3d kind of postcard if I'm calling it that and that's it that's how quick and simple this card was <laughs> hence why I wanted to do it in a real time so I hope you've liked this very quick video I hope you like subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to see more from me and I will see you in the next one guys happy Halloween Bye.